Welcome to the shop. Today uh, is going to end up being part three of the uh, knife sharpening jig. Let's see if I can get it. There we go. Um, let me get the this out of the way. So this portion down in here uh, needs to be worked out so that it does what I need it to do. Uh, and there'll be some Loctite and some machining and stuff like that. I'm not sure how much of it I'll show, but that's where I'm at. Uh, and this is just held in with Loctite and I'll probably whack that out and thread it uh, because it's not centered as much as I'd like. Uh, and the the triangle is too long like to get to the knife so it needs to come like maybe up here so uh, I'll get set up and finish what I'm doing and get right into it oh uh, yeah I suppose it's of no consequence really but uh, I took a minute and built an oil can uh, because I needed one I'm gonna be turning lots of stainless steel and that stuff likes to get really hot and smoke regardless of how much cooling I have on it. So, uh, oil cans, super exciting stuff. All right, still moving on the knife sharpening project. Just had uh, uh, thread this uh, deal here. And I'm gonna, uh, that's uh, 3 8 uh, 16 for those that actually care. Not that it, not that it matters. It's just, but this is going to be the other deal. So there's some tapping and blah 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 coming up. So uh, I'll bring you back later on. Maybe it'll be done. Who knows? Okay. Uh, a few moons later. Ah. Yeah. And the uh, knife sharpener. Let's see. It'd probably help if I got this thing centered, wouldn't it? The life sh knife life knife sharpener is finished so uh and lots of adjustment because it needed it to make this tron triangle is what i'm what i was mentioning in other posts uh, this triangle needed to be quite a bit closer uh to the actual knife to be sharpened in order to achieve a consistent angle uh, this thing flips over it holds a blade blah 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 so it, it does what it's supposed to do and it packs up and it stores pretty well so I don't have a lot of space in my shop and the space that I do have I, I just don't want to have things f falling and flying all over the place so it's it's uh, about as secure as it's gonna get uh, aside from from this which just slides right off but that's the way it needed to be built. And I suppose if I ever get some three quarter inch stainless, I'll make some more uh, shaft collars like these. But you know, I just don't want to care about it right now. So uh, I'll probably put a, probably, blah, 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 probably put a foot on that and, and maybe a couple more things that I'm not thinking of right now. Well, this is gonna have to do for a part three Please take a moment, if it suits you, and like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.